This year we're really proud to be able to present uh, four, four innovations. Uh, we have the new vacuum system called our SmartVac. Uh, we have a new HMI control, which is our data view. Uh, we also have the Ecoline Pro with the integrated peripherals. And as you can see behind me, we have uh, our concept car. And this is the opportunity for the Bueller Group to be able to show to the automotive industry that we're more than just a die casting supplier. We have other technologies uh, such as grinding and dispersion as well as optics from labeled optics that contribute to grow the building a car. For high pressure die casting, we're extremely uh, enthusiastic and uh, confident that it will grow uh, in, in the industry. Uh, we see several areas which are continuing to develop high pressure die casting. First of all, the automotive growth. Uh, second, the need for light weighting driven by the CO2 emissions, uh, which is also uh, driving the electrical cars. But again, we see structural parts being used to take out the additional weight which has been added by the, the batteries. And so we see structural parts driving high pressure die casting. We also see additional parts being created by the electric cars or particularly the hybrid cars, be it the battery cases or the inverter cases. So we see that high pressure die casting will continue to have a very bright future uh, in, the, uh, in the automotive industry. Bueller is a 2.4 billion Swiss franc company. Bueller die casting is uh, approximately 15% of the turner or turnover of, Bueller, of the Bueller group. Being part of Bueller is, brings several advantages. First of all, we have a global presence. Bueller is present in 140 countries. So as Bueller die casting, we can walk into any of our sales and service organizations in any country in the world and have a, a, an immediate presence. So for us, we have the global presence. Second, Bueller is committed to innovation. So again, more than 5% of our turnover goes into developing new solutions, which we now see on the stand today. The other point for also for being part of the, the Bueller Group is the Bueller Group is a family company. It's 154 years old, so Bueller is committed to the long term, and there we have that stability for the future with the Bueller Group. Also, being in the equipment industry, we, can, we know there are cycles. And with the Bueller Group, when one, one business is up, another business might be down, and that allows us to balance out. So we always have the ability to continue to invest even though our business may be down from one, one year to the next. Bueller die casting has a three hub strategy. And for many, many years, Bueller has been looking to uh, be, be actually be more local. So we actually have a three hub strategy. We build machines in North America. We build machines in Europe, not only in Switzerland, but also in Austria. And we also build machines in China. So 80% of our production is actually built outside of Switzerland. So in terms of the exchange rates, yes, we are hit, uh, but we've tried in the past or in the, in the recent past to be able to uh, minimize that impact. So we continue to grow on our three hub. The other element about producing in Switzerland, although most of it's produced outside, is that's where our core technology is. That's where our core competence is. And we're able to use that competence to help our other manufacturing facilities improve their quality and processes. Again, I come back to our three hub strategy in the market for the market. So we try to be as close to our customers as possible in being local. Uh, again, being in North America, being in, uh, in Europe, being in, in, in Asia, being in India. Uh, Bueller has 140 different uh, offices throughout the world. Uh, so we are present in basically every country. So we're able to be closer to the market. So our, uh, our focus on trying to in, in, sorry, trying to maintain our position as a leader is being close to our customers. We try to work more on our services. So again, the service support we bring to our customers, be it reactive support or spare parts for support, but primarily we want to continue to develop the applications and process support for our customers. Bula will continue to develop new innovations. Uh, we will continue to develop in the markets, uh, so in our hubs. We will continue to develop our customer service. We'll continue to develop our product portfolio to be able to bring the right machines to the market. We will continue to develop our structural competence, uh, as well as working on the overall uh, thermal balance to be able to provide more uptime, less cycle time, 
more operational efficiency, and thus more profitability for our customers. We'll also be starting to develop and working more on the automation. As with our new data view, we're trying to find a system or develop the systems which makes it easier for our customers to be able to interact with the machine.